called it the town too tough to die. This is the main street of Helena at its peak in the 1880s, and now just a ghost of its former self. If these rocks could talk. Helena sprung up in 1852, where two old and busy South Texas trade routes came together. It grew quickly and was named the county seat of fledgling Carnes County two years later. The adventure-seeking characters that frequented Helena brought boom times and trouble. Post-Civil War Helena did not lend itself to flattering news stories. One observer noted that many people here had nothing except money for tobacco and whiskey. Consequently, many spent time here. This safe sat in the post office and was a participant in the only robbery that the post office ever had. Uh, two robbers came in masked and blew the safe up with dynamite. Perhaps an aging pistol helped create a few ghosts ahead of their time. Life here in old Helena, especially in the boom times uh, of 1870 and 1880s, is characterized by the first syllable of its name. This well-preserved courthouse in Helena was built in 1873 to house the growing needs of Carnes County. By the 1880s, the population of Helena approached 1,000 people, a sizable number in those days. The coming of the railroad in 1886 meant excitement for Carnes County citizens. And the railroad promoters had approached the people of Helena and demanded a $60,000 bonus from the people of Helena for the privilege of having the railroad come through Helena on the way to the coast. $60,000, that's a lot of money, especially for back then. When Helena couldn't cough up the cash, the previous prosperity of the town vanished, and in just a few years, Helena all but disappeared. The county seat and the railroad moved to Carn City, and Helena's population withered. Then nature took its turn, and less than 20 people remained by the 1950s, a far cry from its heyday. In the 1950s, Carnes County was almost a ghost county because we had the great drought of the 1950s and the population which had lived on the farms and ranches just dispersed. Now, however, Helena is experiencing a rebirth. Interest in the town's rich past is bringing in history buffs over 3,000 last year to see what was once called the toughest town on earth. Steve Lenore, KSAT 12 News.